Everyone says this is a bad economy. You hear that over and over. You've been hearing that for years now. Two, three, four years now. It's a bad economy. Should we thus believe it's a bad economy? Everyone says it, therefore we should believe it, right? I don't think this is a bad economy. Why would it be a bad economy? We need to ask ourselves, what makes an economy bad? Because the media says the economy is bad. That alone does not make an economy bad. I hear motivational speakers talk about how there were people who didn't use even the Great Depression as a crutch and excuse, and they still succeeded. Indeed, that's the way to look at it. You hear people use the economy as an excuse all the time. What is a bad economy? Why is this called a bad economy? Is it because this economy is not as good as it was in the 90s? If that's a bad economy, then if I gain two pounds from my ideal weight, then I'm fat. No, I don't think so. If I gain 40 pounds from my ideal weight, then I'm fat. Two pounds? No. I don't like to see it go up because I fear it'll keep going up, but that doesn't make me fat. Likewise, the economy is not going to always be 100% good. People point to high unemployment. What is high unemployment? People say we have 6%, 8% unemployment. Is a glass half empty or half full? We have 92% employment, 94% employment. That's pretty good employment. When I was in Swaziland, I read that the unemployment rate there was 25%. Now that's a bad economy. There's not growth going on, but does that make an economy bad? I don't think so. I had the privilege of visiting Zimbabwe in March and April of 2010. I came there as their economy was recovering in their eyes. One thing that really stood out was when somebody said to me, we have just started to get food back into the grocery store in the last six months. During much of the 2000s, Zimbabwe was in a crisis. They had, according to the statistics, the second highest rate of hyperinflation in world history. There was starvation. The stores had no food. Now that is what I call a bad economy. Our stores here, we have food in them. Even during bad economies, we have food in them. We don't have hyperinflation, sure. The dollar has fallen in value, sure. There is inflation. Sure, sure, sure. Things aren't perfect. I'm not saying we shouldn't strive to get better. We shouldn't keep pushing upward. But I don't think we have a bad economy. The economy is quite good.